Hello guys welcome back to the channel i hope you are doing extremely fine my name is prince and you are watching the tech stream in this video i am going to review extended xt android 13 custom rom for the oneplus 9 series devices so without wasting any more time let's get started so i have installed extended xt on my oneplus 9 pro and this rom is available for oneplus 9 also if i go into the about info section you can see that the android version is 13 and the android security patch is of 5th november 2022 now let's see what all this rom provides and what not i have installed this build directly on Oxygen OS 13. Comment down if you want to have an installation video about the same. Coming to the basic functionality, all the basic functionality is working fine. Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, NFC, and calling is working without any problems. Apart from that, you also get fingerprint to unlock functionality with this ROM, and you also get face to unlock and app unlock features with this ROM. If I talk about the launcher, you get the extended launcher, which is better than the stock Pixel launcher, as it has some customization option available. From the first look, the ROM feels fast, stable, and snappy. And moving on, as I've already shown. So new, this is an Android 13 based build. So you have all the latest and best features of Android 13, like more accent color to choose from in the wallpaper and color section, new music player widget and output picker, and other features. So all the latest Android 13 features are there and working well. All your banking and payment apps will just work fine as the ROM passes safety net tests out of the box. And if I show you the Widevine Security L1, that is L3, so you might face some problem while streaming HD content on Netflix and other streaming sites. Moving on, you get fully working Oxygenos camera and gallery app, and all. the modes of oxygenos camera are also working without any issues talking about battery i didn't face any drains as such but i will use this rom for a week or so and i will update you with all the builds about the battery so press the subscribe button to not miss those videos talking about gaming you get full 90 fps support in bgmi as you can see in bgmi settings you have the option to select 90 fps and you can play on 90 fps also the gaming performance look very good initially comment down if you want me to do a full gaming review of this rom now let's talk about the customization option that are available if you move on to settings there's an option for extension and here we have all the different apps first up we have ambient decor which contains all the ambient display settings next up we have animation settings which have screen off power menu and qr style animations then we have some button settings like music control volume locker way under gestures we have all the gesture settings under lock screen you get lock screen settings with ud fps options to select a custom fingerprint icon and animations inside navigation you can change the navigation styles under notification you get the options like heads up notification general notification and breaking notification inside qs we can change the qs style layout brightness light and other quick settings option inside status bar we get all the status bar options like clock date and network traffic indicator under theme room we have the dark theme wifi icon signal icon and font styles and finally under extra we have game space and burn in protection settings and last but not the least at the bottom we also get some device extra settings like alert slider customization and touch screen gestures wow those were a plethora of options and extended roms are really known for their customization settings so should you install this rom yes you should definitely try out this rom till now i have not faced any bugs on this rom and everything is working just smoothly in fact i'm using it as a daily driver on my oneplus 9 pro and you also get full oxygenos camera and gallery support with this one thanks to the developer for pushing out so many updates comment down if you want me to make an installation video for the same also i make a lot of rom reviews and i'll be trying other android 13 rom subscribe to the channel to not miss those videos thank you for watching